Hello everybody and welcome back. My name is Digi and today I am showing you guys how to get Gallant Gaming, Funtime Foxy, and Funtime Freddy. But before we keep going, shout out of the day goes to Goat Light. Thank you for being first at commenting first. Alright, so let's go ahead and get right into it. Click start and we're going to be going to one location that will have all three of the badges. Okay, now there is going to be a bit of counting. So have a paper, pen, pencil, whatever. What we're going to do is head over this way to the Superstar Arcade. Essentially a arcade system or arcade world. Um, if you don't want to fight mobs, just keep running. Ignore them because we're not here to fight them. We're here to get some badges. So right over here is going to be the Superstar Arcade. Okay, so Funtime Foxy and Funtime Freddy are going to be right over this way on the main stage. This is Funtime Foxy's and this is Funtime Freddy. I'm going to break this down as best as I can. Funtime Foxy, what we're doing for both of them is figuring out the code. Now the code for Funtime Foxy is going to require you to have to look for red, green, and blue objects. Now, this is the order of the code. So, if you find one red object, three green objects, four red op or four blue objects, then that is how the order will be. It'll be one, three, four. Okay? Now, these objects can range from a bunch of things to the duck, to the cups, to the plates. And then we've got books, we've got teddy bears. Um, there is, okay, right over here is foxy's mask sometimes there's a soccer ball underneath the table so another thing is my code is going to be different than your code for every server you leave a server and join a different one your code is going to be different in there so don't copy my codes it won't work for you now what's great about this is the locations will not change okay now, yes, some items will be missing. For example, like the soccer ball is not there this time. So, but they'll always spawn in their same spots. It's not super random, okay? And then over here, I do want to help you explain. The colored books are the ones you want to count. The white parts of the books do not count. So just look for the colored. And just to let you know, these will always be one, two, three, four, five books right here in color. All right, so if you see colored books, it's always going to be five. It's not going to be less than or more. Another thing is right here, this basket of exotic butters will have different colored ones as well. What I've noticed is every time there's some color object or colored exotic butters in here, it's always going to be six, okay? So let me go ahead and give you an example. So I'm going to do fun time foxy. So I'm going to look for all of the red, green, and blue. So here we go. So we've got one blue duck, and this is why you want a pen and pencil and paper. So then you can write down these numbers, okay? Then we got one blue duck over there, that's two. And then we've got one red book right here. Now, there are obviously other colors here, but we're doing fun time foxies. So just focus on one at a time, or you can do it all at the same time. It is completely up to you here's another location then right over here this spider is green and i believe there's only one spider here always so when you see that essentially is just one we've got another duck right over here that is three then there should be not always not always like i said sometimes some of the objects don't spawn in so for me yep okay so there's a foxy mask right there but that's black We've got a duck up there. That's four for me. We got a book right here. That is two. All right. Then we're going to go to the front here like I did before. Add five. So one, two, three, four, five. Okay. And then there's another duck up there. That is a total of five. So boom. So what I'm going to do then is take all my numbers so i have seven red objects so that will be seven i've got one green spider that's one and then five blue ducks that is gonna be five so hopefully this works out <laughs> seven one five 
And if it does, this will open up. Then we're going to go ahead and bump into Funtime Foxy and they will talk to you. So that is an example of the Funtime Foxy. But there you go. You have a new party member, Funtime Foxy, and then you will get your badge. All right, let's go ahead and do Funtime Freddy. So the same thing, light blue, purple, yellow, black. That is going to be the order of the code. So right over here, we already got ourselves a black Foxy mask. And the colors will always change. So the black foxy masks will not always be black. They can be yellow. They can be green. It will change. All right. Anyway, so we've got one, two light blues or cyan, whatever you want to say. We got one, two, three plates. I'm looking down because I'm writing these all down. That's why. Okay. Now over here, we always have six plates and six cups. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six. And then we've got another six cups. So one, two, three, four, five, six. All right. And then we've got a purple, um, I guess, teddy bear. <laughs> I don't know. Plushy, whatever you want to call it. Then we've got another foxy mask over there. That is two. All right, that should be all of the stuff in there. They're always going to be inside of the arcade, okay? They will not change outside. They'll always be inside here. All right, that's a second purple teddy bear. Um, we already got that. We've got that. There should be, yep, there's that black foxy mask from earlier. Then let's go to the front here. Let's go over here. Let's see, I think it was just blue. Ah, right, yes, there it is. A purple Freddy plushie. And I think that should be all of the colors. Now, for me, there are no exotic butters in there, so we're not going to worry about it. So, if I've done this correctly, mine should be a 3393. Three, three. Wow, that's a lot of threes. So, let's see if I did this right. So, here we go 3393. Three, open ooh so i must have missed one so then you just go back and look for it and then come back again all right so i actually did miss another foxy mask it's right here the black ones are really difficult so you really got to make sure you look carefully so let's try this again so i actually did mess up on the first one it was supposed to be an eight not a three so eight three nine four there we go then that means you have got it correct. Now let's go ahead and collect Fun Time Freddy. Bump into him, chit chat with him there, and then you should get. Wait for it. A new party member, and then the badge should show up at the bottom right. There you go. Now to get Gallant Gaming, this one's a little harder. I actually haven't gotten it. If you go over here to the arcades over on this side, you can see Gallant over there. What you doing, boy? Gallant, you stinky. You a rat. Just kidding. He's my good friend. We talk a bit like that to each other. <laughs> Alright. Hello there, my fellow knight. Chicken. Um, so essentially what you're gonna have to do is collect all of the FNAF 1 AR characters. Right there. Go hunt some AR characters. Unlock all of the FNAF 1 AR skins available, then come talk to Gallant again. So, I doubt the event ones are going to be the ones that are required because, you know, events end and you can't collect it. So, it's going to be the ones that are always obtainable. Once you get all those, then you just come back to this fellow, this stinky boy, and talk to him and you should get the badge. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe down below, and join the badge hunting squad today. Use star code DJ whenever you buy Robux or Premium. As always, stay awesome, stay cool, go love badge hunting. Bye-bye.